Elliot here with Teco, and today we are checking out Super Pedestrian's Copenhagen Wheel. The wheel enhances your pedaling power, making even the steepest of inclines a breeze. It was created as a spin-off from MIT, and is designed to fit practically any single or geared bike. Unfortunately, no such luck for us carbon fiber riders. With an estimated top speed of 20 miles per hour, it has a range of about 30 miles depending on your speed settings and the hills that you are riding on. It also has regenerative braking, sort of like a Prius. However, due to US regulations, the motor does have to shut off after exceeding 20 miles per hour. So it sort of acts as a governor, uh, and it will kind of feel like you are being held back until it decelerates to under 20 miles per hour. There are five ride modes, standard, turbo, eco, exercise, and off. Each gives you data no matter what, but the others give you various speed variances, or elongates your battery. However, exercise mode also adds a little bit of extra resistance to it, causing you to, you know, burn a few extra calories. Within the app, it will track things like trips, distance, duration, average speed, calories burned, and most importantly, how much you work versus how much the wheel is actually working. The app also monitors the health of the wheel, just like Automatic Pro does for a car. The built-in motor pushes out 350 watts, with a 48 volt lithium ion battery. Batteries should have a life cycle of about 1000 charges. For the charge time, it will take anywhere from about two to four hours, two in particular for about 80%, four for about 100%. The hub itself will weigh just under 17 pounds, but that will also basically double any weight of a standard road bike. If you get one of their bikes, which we are featuring here in particular, the Trouser Edition, it features leather grips and leather saddle, which I should mention is also horribly uncomfortable. Kendra Quest 35C wheels, a 40-15 gear ratio, Tektro R369 road brake caliper brakes, a powder-coated chrome steel frame, and in this particular edition it has a bike rack, so that also has a powder-coated frame. The wheel itself retails for about $1,500, but if you prefer one of their bikes with it pre-installed, it will cost you $2,000. This particular model, again, is the Trouser Edition, and it comes in either white or black. They also offer monthly installment payments if that is your preference.